Welcome, sports fans. Back again today. We have a shot. Oh, go, can you go put that on the door, man? We have a double unboxing. Stewie's still here. Um, I'll tell you what you do. Stewie's away on the boat today. No plane. That's why you're on the plane. No. Tomorrow. No. So, if you guys can, we'll be more than happy to get your name. Think of a screen name or screen identity for Stewie. And we'll work on his PlayStation ID when he gets back. How about that for us? So, you write it in, and Muttley's been taken, so we can't have that. There's a, a Muttley in Aberdeen, I know, and she she works for something else. So, we can't get Muttley, and he's deeply distraught about that, as you can see from the giggles. And on a later show, we will talk about um, your, your previous nicknames at the work. <laughs> And uh, w hopefully we'll come it's higher now. It's gone more. Is it? It's gone more. Oh jeez, it's gone up. So we, you, you came. Jacob's com commissar Jake, like mm -hmm. a Russian general, basically is what it means. Everybody knows me as Big Red, aka Alucard. Even though I'm now playing in a team which is blue and black, so it could be nicknamed Big Blue. But never mind. Yes, no haters on my channel for the the icon on his chest okay I'm not a football supporter so no hate mail no, no nasty vulgar comments please and just and it's the reason I'm not wearing red just because he's anti-blue but he, he, he really doesn't care about football he, he just likes the gear mm. but anyway back to the unboxing we have a treat for you today we have Loot Crate has arrived so we have a stream and an unboxing. Now, Shuri doesn't know much about uh, Loot Crate, do you? Never heard of them. Loot Crate is for all of us geeky gamers. We occasionally we get uh, um, free gifts. You, you see it in the thing. Uh, Melanie Mac gets Loot Crate and she gets bento boxes. But uh, I think mum would literally kill me by the amount of... It's, like, it's worse than Reader's Digest. You know, you get tons yeah. and tons and tons of mail, and mum would personally kill me. So, that aside, we've got Loot Crate, and we have the, the Lion 360 set as a controller, so we'll, we'll get to that in a minute. So, back to Loot Crate, guys, as you can see. Uh, the first Loot Crate video went on on Steven's channel, on the, on the clan channel, which is... Fair, because it was really meant to be done as a group, but uh, there we go. I love that, it's on pretty much every box. So you just go, ah, on that. So, as you can see, there we go. So, oh, oh, I got, oh, official member of Loot Crate, I got my Looter card. Hmm. So, I wonder what I have gotten today. Well, this is another... I, I, I just got these because I, I every second one you get a t-shirt. So, there we go. That's a, a Link Gaming t-shirt from Link of the Time. That's cool. I, I, I didn't look at the spoilers for this one. Which actually things are here. What? Another character. Yeah, it's Link. That's not. It's Link. It's, it's Zelda. No, Zelda's the wife. Link's the guy. Link's That's, the elf. Is it? Yeah. Oh, she's fine. Oh, okay. I didn't, I didn't see the face back. Yeah. Well, What's that? that? This is a Minecraft hanger. So, I'm not actually a member of Minecraft. I tried Minecraft for that. Now, if some of you are players, you kind of, you kind of say that the game is crap, it's just it's not your kind of game. But it's that difficult to work. Let me help you. So, it's a keychain. Cool. Oh, it's one of these, it's one of the evil creature guys from, from Minecraft. And it's cool to find he's lime green, because I only ever watch Minecraft because Optic play it. So, that's kind of cool. 
Um, right, we have a bottle opener. It's a bottle opener, but it's not what the... I'm trying to think what that looks like. Oh, God, it's, like it. it's dangerous to go it alone. Oh, right, so the loot box theme of today is classic Nintendo and pixelated games. That's from... Link on the NES that's on a lovely key fog and bottle opener. And we've got another badge. So the loot crate is the adventure badge. And we've got more loot crate. I actually have three badges. I now need to get something to put the badges on. We've got a big box. And we have a big box. What is this? Oh, it's a figure inside. So Funiko has got one thing. I don't know what this is for, I'm sure. Somebody somewhere will tell me what that's from, but at the moment I haven't a clue. It's another character. I gotta be careful. I did this the last time on a loot crate and sank the knife straight into the top of my finger. And to say, must be a game of some sort. No, it's from it's Cartoon Network. Cartoon Network. Yeah, it's from the Cartoon Network. I don't know. Let's have a look at it. Well, once I get the plastic out, yeah. Yeah, no, when you get, whenever you get there. I watched a lot of that, I used to watch a lot of that, I had to make lots of Yeah, a lot of people did. It's called the Finico. Collect all 12. Never heard of them. I haven't either. I'll, I'll let you read the packaging. There you go. I'm sure you'll have a better idea than me. Oh, shit. I'm sure all you guys will recognize this, and somebody I'm sure will either tweet me or... Oh, it's now on CITV. Well, what is it? It's, it's, a pretty, it's a pretty guy who made a cartoon. It's like uh, Walls and Gromit. I don't think it's quite like Walls and Gromit. No, no, it's the same, it's same, same style. No, it's pixelated. It's done like Minecraft. There you go, there's one. Never seen him on it. Yeah, anyway. Yeah. You want that better? Yeah. Anything? Oh, you got some stickers? I do, actually. Have some stickers. CD. Well, is it a CD? CD. Oh, it is a CD. Yeah. Okay, the soundtrack to the friend zone. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Must be something to do with this Cartoon Network thing. And here we go. Well, so Captain Sparkle stickers. Never heard of them. For all you guys back home, there we go. Mark Plier Cats must be for something to do. Later stickers. Oh, there's more stickers. Hmm. <laughs> I like that anime one. There we guys go. We've got tons of stickers this one. So yeah, my box is probably going to get vandalized by me. We'll put all this back in here. That was the the loot crate. What's the well the t-shirt's gotta go in the wash probably. Mm -hmm. T-shirt is going to wash. Is that everything? Okay. Uh -huh. yeah, that's, that's it. The loot crate. That, that's kind of good. That's been quite not a bad one. It's not been quite as I would say as good as the um the Titanfall one is still my best unboxed one. So here's the one we've all been waiting for. Oh yeah, yeah. So here we go. This is the one this is the, from Lime360. Let's see what they've sent me today. I see the mic already done pretty fast. Oh, I want to get a first. Jesus Christ, you certainly boxed it up. What? Whole paperwork has to be kept together. Oh, I'm going to see if it's still stuff you got. Oh, no, no. I take the fun, the fun of the unboxing. I don't do that, I'll check what I get first if I open it up. Yeah, let's see, this is why. I'll get him trained in unboxing, guys, don't worry about it. <laughs> I'll get him trained. This is kind of funny, because all the Xbox stuff was white controllers and black boxes, right? But for Xbox One... We have white box for black control. Turn it upside down, the other way around. No, I can't see it. 
There we go. So, and I got to see another one that's not sealed. I swear to heavens, they get them made up and then just there's a guy that just forgets stuff. They're not illegal. No, it's not illegal, it's just unsanitary. But I suppose it is a controller. So, as we get to the unboxing, I'm going to have to do like some severe editing in most of these videos before we put them on YouTube. So, there we go. That's your things, and of course, the controller's upside down. So, there we go. That's massively bright red, but there we go. I don't own a key. I don't know why they keep sending me these instructions on the keys when they don't bring you one. Well, they probably does. Oh, maybe they do. Maybe they do. Maybe they do. Not, not quite. Oh. That's interesting. That didn't come with the other one. Ooh, pop that over there. So. Well, there's my thing. Oh my god, this has got a different grip. Have a look guys, I'll let you see the back. Here's the the, the panels. And like the guy says on the video, there's the battery thing off. Oh, <laughs> my control box is falling out. And we've got, ooh, let's see. we got a screwdriver as well. We've got screwdrivers and a Cool. Oh, not that far game thing, have you? I must, I must admit, that's a first for me as well. There we go. I'm not a big fan. I thought they would have given it like free charging. I just dropped the battery in there. <laughs> I'm getting there. No, they, they've given us batteries, which kind of sucks. But I'm sure at a later date, if I get tired of batteries, then we shall get um, the rechargeable power packs. It just means it's another that I've got to put the controller in and update the controller mm -hmm. for the headset. There's no big deal on that one. But that's actually might be worth while to do that now. Right, okay, so let's, this is pretty much this scuff. Uh, I won't probably know until, unfortunately we'll have to um, update the controller first. Did you get that back in? There we go. That's unusual, I, those sticks don't look the right size. Oh. Oh, now see why you get, um, you've got to take the cover out. If you want to adjust these, you actually have to dismantle a whole case. Take this whole case off. Like, there's screws behind there, and then you, you take it off, because the trigger play is, is really kind of weird. Now, there's a reason why there are two of these. Because... Um, to put it bluntly, the guy turned around and told me that a regular set of vortexes will fit. So, we shall see. Because I really like the vortexes, which is the ones I have on my other scope. Now, and that one will go on that one. Hmm. I can't wait to it, but it looks cool. Because I'm, I'm gradually getting used to like working with scuffs, and my other scuff is fantastic. And all that. So, that's quite nice. On the other note, pop the batteries up there. Let's stop charging, that's amazing. These ones, if I can get them out, will go on the other one. Um, I'm going to get Stewie at some point, he's going to have a, a field day working with, um, see what I mean, I had to get ones that fit. Because you like, you, you, 
you're a, you're a converted pastor and you want to watch stuff too. Uh -huh. So, anyway, before I forget, let's um, gonna check them out. let's that's that control is charged. It's not so much charged. It's should open the remote menu. This is so tight when you first get them because it's a a freaking new controller. You're not looking up when they come going. Well, it does, but it's just it's bloody awkward trying to get the fucking thing in. You can't update the controller unless this thing is pushed it plugged in. No, definitely. I'm trying to see if it'll push back into this one. Oh shit, it's all gone. See what I mean? Is this bit here? Oh. It's not bit there. Oh. There we go. I guess it is. You just that in and then all of a sudden it's that in. Right. Okay. There we go. I'll we'll plug this beastie boy in here. And the other end goes into here. Just when Xbox, turn on. It's got these other heads in there. Oh, the headset's fine. You have to the headset out in a minute. Um, what's that? Ghost, ghost. System if I remember correctly, and update controller. Continue. God, heat in here. Hmm. You're done to the heat. Hmm? You're done to the heat. It's just coming out of the PC. But anyway, we'll get back to. You tried the scuff on the 360, didn't you? Well, when we played the zombies. Yeah. No, no, that was the PlayStation one. PlayStation, I haven't tried the Xbox. No, it's PlayStation, but not the Xbox one. No, we didn't know how you shot on the Xbox, just me and you. Yeah, well, it wasn't the scuff one I tried. It wasn't, it wasn't that one you gave me. It was this one you gave me. No, of course it wasn't. No, I mean on the Xbox 360, because it not that green one over there. Yeah, don't give me that green yet. Don't give me that one yet. All right, all right. Well, you're too, you're too into it at that point. Oh, what was that? Well, there it is. So it is fair. But, so, in comparison, what do you think is the difference between Xbox and PlayStation? Well, the Xbox um, is easier. I think it's easier to work with. But the 360 is easier. Than the PlayStation 3? 
Resident Evil 3, you got you got better problems with it sometimes. Mm. The game sometimes three and sometimes on you. Oh yeah, but that hands on the Xbox. We you, you just haven't run to that on bad. That happens, yeah. No, did we not play Call of Duty Modern Warfare? And you get a shot of the scuff. Nope. Uh, it was only it was only in the PS3 only. Alright. Oh, PS3 and the and the PS4 wasn't that. Yeah, oh, oh, another update, Keith. Oh no, controller's updated. That's good, that's fine. What happened there? That's it actually in place. Is that you, is that you got the controller set up there? No, we need to run it again. But anyway, we'll get back to the video. Right, so, on, as you can see from the controller, we've got the scuff. I couldn't get red ones. I mean, I can get red ones, but I think having them look the same. Now, that's kind of cool because that's domed and that's not. So it, it, it's quite nice. And there we go. Watched. Oh, yeah, you can plug Sky into this. Yeah, I mean, I'm missing that. PS4 can do that. A PS3 is not empty. Oh, I'm not. Yeah, see what I mean? It says plug it into the. Ta -da -da -da. If you got, they've got an older one, not you already. Xbox, go home. <laughs> it's kind of weird doing that, like, but there you go. Let me... So, all right, okay, that's done. So I can now. Unplug that. Put your battery on. It's been popping back. Easy. Pop that one, and then I'll have my. Weird. Right. Um, if I push the button on that, we'll get to see. Uh -huh. Right. So. The flash is there. Right. So I go click. You must be sending into Xbox Live. Right. Right. Hang on. Choose this person. Right. Hold on, two seconds. What's happening? Close. Oh, I, I took over YouTube today. No, I'll well, have two ones, me and. Alright, right, you. No, I'm this one, you muppet. Alright. No, this is no. What did you do? Oh, it's been a pain. I do have a lot of keys. Now let me do that. Right, that's me. And no, you should hold on. You press A. And that so that so works. That's the only thing I must admit with these control with the old-fashioned 360 controllers 
is it had an indication of who was player one and who was player two, three, and four. The controller has been paired to turn the profile. Oh, okay. Just go click. Sign as a preview. Yeah, click up and go click. Click yes? Yeah. Ah! Right, that's me. Uh, hang on. Click no. It's weird. I can have a remote control. Cool. Mm. Oh, I thought you might have control over it. You must be silent. Right, okay. That's me. Now you push it. Right, okay. Oh, God. Oh, two seconds. Hold on, two seconds. What's happened? I need to sort of out. Ah! Did you? Oh, one. There we go. No, that's all me back, was it? Well, I thought it would have automatically switched over once we unplugged it. Right. Did you? I had nothing to talk to you now. Right, okay. Um, okay, guys, we're going to uh, end the stream here. That was the unboxing and a bit of a vlog on the scuff controller and the loop crate we will be back later on in the week or maybe next week with a bit of a review i'm going to probably do a quick review with the astro red head astro neon red headset uh working it with the scuff since we've got this lovely red thing and we will catch you all later so that's peace out for me and we'll catch you all and if you can't go big, kill everything. <laughs>